Hi, welcome, Simon here. In this video, I'll be replacing DC jack on an HP computer. So what happened is that the computer fell on the side and it kind of damaged the, uh, the charging port. So you can see that the plastic broke off and the charging port is just not taking the charge. So one way to do it is to um, get this DC jack replaced. Luckily, the DC jack is a replaceable item rather than soldered onto the motherboard. So certain DC jack, they actually solder to the motherboard, which you may need soldering. But for my case, it is a replaceable part that we can order online. And if you're not sure where to buy the uh, DC jack, please check the link down description below. I'll link it to either Amazon or eBay, where you can find the replacement jack uh, for this repair. Okay, so I'm using a Phillips screwdriver here. I'm remo removing all the screws because we need to remove the back cover in order to um, replace that DC jack. And again, the computer has the rubber stopper, the little plastic that was here, it's already been peeled. Uh, but if your computer still have that rubber plastic, you need to peel that rubber plastic before you can remove all the screws. All right, so once I have removed all the screws, the next step for me to do is to uh, remove the back cover here. Let's go ahead and pry it open. What I like to do is I like to uh, focus here on the corner. Usually the corner is where you should be focusing first because they tend to be easier to uh, be removed. Once I have enough of a gap, what I like to do is to get the plastic prying tool to kind of go across the, uh, the cover here. Once the back cover is removed, you then can see the entire um, internal part of the computer. Let's identify that DC jack is on the top left corner. We need to get a Phillips screwdriver here, remove the three screws so that we can release the left hinge in order for the DC jack to come out. So that three screws here is held down, holding down the DC jack. What I like to do is to go ahead and get underneath that um, hinge. And to remove it, I simply just slide the connector down, follow the cable right there, trace it all the way, and gently just kind of remove it. Now to install, you just have to push it back in like such. I make sure that the connector, that golden plate is facing above, it's facing on top of you, and then gently just push it in. Okay, put the hinge back down.
and that should be it so it's pretty straightforward nothing really uh, that difficult to replace that DC jack the next is to have the back cover to install back in so what I like to do is I like to go on the top here first I'll press it down Okay, once you have everything inserted, the next step is to have the screws to go back in and that should be it. So it's very straightforward, nothing that complicated and have all the screws back in. So what I like to do is to share the link down description below where you can find the replacement DC jack on eBay or Amazon. So check the link if you need to change out your DC jack and thanks for watching. Until next time, take care and bye now.